Ah, uh, yes, our Capital Region Spring Training Tour continues. All week long, we've been talking to our local Capital Region baseball players who are on the verge of heading out to spring training. And now on the phone with us, LaSalle High School graduate Will Remillard in the Chicago Cubs organization. Will, you're coming off Tommy John surgery. You report to minicamp on Wednesday. How ready are you to get back on the field? Yeah, I can't wait. You know, it's been well over a year now since I've even been in a game and gotten in at bat. And, uh, it's been a grind for sure, but I'm ready to get back on the field and, and start playing every day again. You know, I, I talked to Jeff Hoffman uh, a couple of months ago, and I asked him what the rehab process is like for Tommy John, but what was your experience? How grueling is it to get back? Uh, it's tough. Um, you know, it, it, it takes the game totally away from you for that period of time, and, and you know, you're just going through the process of, of trying to get back, and, you know, it's a lot of repetition and the same thing every day over and over again and, and it's mentally draining as well as you know physically challenging to to make the jump all the way back to being ready to play in a game are you completely healthy here heading into 2016 yeah yep i'm uh i'm fully ready to go and excited to get back out on the field definitely now baseball america at one point called you the cubs best defensive catching prospect do you know what the plan is this year? Are you going to be able to catch every day coming off Tommy John? Are you going to split some time between catching and DH? Do you know what the plan is? I'm not sure what the plan is. Um, once I get to Arizona, I'm sure I'll have a sit down and, and figure out all that information. Um, I don't think I would um, come right off Tommy John and, and be catching you know every single day, but um, I'll play as much as my body allows me and, and go from there. Obviously, Tommy John is something that, that we, we link with pitchers because it's so much more frequent, but Matt Weeders of the Orioles is another catcher who's coming off Tommy John surgery recently as well. Did, did the doctors kind of tell you how freak it is to see a position player uh, to have to have this procedure? Uh, it's just one of those things where, you know, you, you throw one ball and and it kind of goes on you, and then, uh, and then you got to deal with it. Now, you've had injuries, unfortunately, ever since you got drafted in 2013. Well, you missed your, your entire first season after getting drafted, too, right? I did, yeah. What? I, had a, uh, I had a back problem um, going into the draft and uh, was unable to play until the following uh, spring training. So how frustrating has it been to up until this point, and then just how gratifying is it this year to know you're going in completely healthy? It's been a frustrating road so far, but uh, I'm trying to, you know, stay mentally strong and and just really focus on doing what I need to do to try to stay healthy. And and I'm grateful that I'm still getting the opportunity to go out there and, and show what I can do and, and being a part of the Cubs organization. It's Capital Region Sports Saturday, brought to you by Mohawk Honda, your number one volume dealer in the Capital Region. On the phone right now, Will Remillard, LaSalle High School, Coastal Carolina product in the Chicago Cubs system. And, Will, it's an exciting time to be in that Cubs system. I mean, a lot of young talent, Chris Bryant, Kyle Schwarber, they signed Ben Zobers. The Cubs are a favorite in the NL. Pretty cool time to be around Chicago, huh? It's amazing what, what the organization has been able to do and Sticking with the process and the fans, especially being patient with with the organization, and it's come a long way. And you know, now they're the favorite to win the World Series, so we'll see where it goes. So we've talked all week long to different Capital Region guys. We talked to J.P. Sportman, Jamie Schultz, uh, Mike Fish, uh, Garrett Whitley. We've talked to everybody pretty much from the Capital Region. Are you friends with those guys? And what? How cool is it for you to kind of be part of that group of Capital Region guys that are close to the big leagues? Yeah, it's awesome. Uh, a lot of those guys I played with, and uh, you know they're great players. And you know, to have more and more people coming out of you know upstate New York, it, it's great. Um, you know, when I was in high school, and you know before me, especially, it was you know kind of a it wasn't really a thought to to get drafted out of high school and and be the guy that you know goes in the first round out of out of New York. But now it's becoming a more of a, more of a popular thing and finally starting to get some recognition in that area. We're probably going to have another uh, kid from upstate New York taken in the first round. Ian Anderson, a pitcher from Shen right out of high school. He'll be, he's 90 to 94 uh, on the mound right now. So it looks like it's going to continue for the capital region. Will Remillard, Chicago Cubs organization, LaSalle high school graduate. Will, thanks for being with us. Stay healthy. and We'll talk to you again soon. Thanks for having me.